now dear student we are going to discuss question number 2.17 and in this question it is given to you a long charge cylinder of linear charge density lambda is surrounded by a hollow coaxial conducting cylinder fine what is electric field in the space between two cylinder clear so now concentrate on a screen in this question it is given to you a long cylinder of linear charge density given lambda so let's suppose here we have this long cylinder clear this is a cylinder this one let's suppose we have this long uh, we have a long charge cylinder clear and let's suppose i am providing here positive charge on this cylinder let's suppose clear positive charge let's suppose i am assuming length of this cylinder is capital l clear to you okay it is also given linear charge density we have that is lambda clear just remember linear charge density is provided to you now what is linear charge density linear charge density is defined as a charge present on a conducting body divided by length or we can say per unit length clear so we can see lambda is already defined it means you can write like this lambda this is equal to q by l so q is given by lambda times of l okay clear to you so this is lambda times of l q equal to lambda times of l clear now in this question it is given a uh, it is surrounded by a hollow coaxial conducting cylinder it means we can see let's suppose here we have this hollow cylinder this one like this clear we have this hollow cylinder clear so let's suppose this is a hollow cylinder and we can see it is surrounded this given cylinder clear and this is conducting cylinder now we know due to this positive charge negative charges are induced on the inner surface of this cylinder because this is a neutral cylinder or we can say there is no any charge present on this cylinder so we can see outside positive charges are developed clear to you yes so positive charge is developed outside now let's suppose we can say this is axis of this cylinder now what is our objective in this question objective is clear what is electric field in the space between these two cylinder so if we want to calculate value of electric field first we are going to draw here a gaussian surface so how can we draw here gaussian surface it will be look like this this one let's suppose this is gaussian surface this one clear to everyone and let's suppose i am assuming radius of this gaussian surface is r clear so now we can write here gauss law for this uh, situation so i am writing here gauss law says net flux this is given by q net divided by epsilon not clear now we can say here inside this gaussian surface we have only positive charges so we can also write like this this is integral of e dot da and this should be equal to q net divided by epsilon not clear to you now let's suppose if we take here a very small element it is having an area da listen carefully what i am saying to you because positive charges are present here also we have a positive charge so let's suppose i am assuming net electric field direction inside or uh, between the space or between we can say net electric field between these two cylinder is given by e let's suppose because this is area so area vector is also in the same direction clear so we can say angle between e and da is zero so now we can write like this this is e da cos of zero and this should be equal to okay listen carefully charge enclosed in the gaussian surface now we know linear charge density is given so how can we calculate total charge this is lambda times of l so i can write like this lambda l divided by epsilon not clear to everyone so now we can write like this this is e integral of da this should be equal to lambda l over epsilon not clear now what is value of area so if we talk about surface area we can write like this this is 2 pi r multiplied with l clear so now we can say this is equal to e times 2 pi r multiply l this should be equal to lambda l upon 
epsilon naught. Clear to everyone? So from here we can say L and L is cancelled out. So value of E, this is given by lambda over 2 pi epsilon naught into R. Clear? E equal to lambda upon 2 pi epsilon naught into R. Clear? Or you can also write like this, E equal to 2k lambda upon R. Clear? E equal to 2k lambda upon R. It means we can say this is value of electric field. This is uh, between these two coaxial cylinders. Clear to everyone? So this is the answer of this question.